Well, he's not playing tomorrow, so it's difficult to assess with the hamstrings. It's obviously we hope we have him back quickly. He uh, did a bit of jogging this morning, but that's all. And uh, it's difficult to say. Um, but it's straightforward. It's a dead leg he got on Saturday. He should be ready for sat uh, next Saturday. Sir Alex, can't see in Munich today. There's no ring at the at uh, the airport. The memory of the people dying in the traffic. Do you think that shows that the two clubs are quite maybe a poor relationship between the supporters? The two clubs can rise above those issues. Well, I think it's refreshing. I think that we appreciate that from Manchester City. And um, of course, uh, one of their, their own players was killed in the crash. Or former players, anyway. But it's refreshing. I think it's a good sign that the game is not as bad as sometimes we think. I think there's an element of supporters' contribution in a different way, which is not nice. Oh, we appreciate what Manchester City are doing. If that's the case, well done. Well, we played Basel a few years ago, and they've always been the, the premier team in Switzerland, obviously. Other of them are FC Zurich. There was a spell there when they were starting to produce good young players. In fact, they got to the final, the under 20 ones last year, and, and it appeared at the time of um, Senderos' team was producing some good young players. And they've been doing that for quite a few years now, getting younger players through, which is gives them uh, good merit in terms of scouting in, in Europe. A lot of teams are now, clubs are now start to scout in Switzerland. Um, and the national team has always been uh, reasonably good. Uh, they, they always seem to represent themselves quite well. And of course, the Basel team have good experience, been in Europe quite a few times. So, we'll respect that.